guys. So today I'm going to be showing you guys a little bit of customization I'm going to be doing on my camper shell right here. You guys have seen it in some past videos, but uh, I took it off and kind of just let it sit in my garage for a long time. It got all dusty and gross. I'm kind of using it as like a paint booth almost. I knew I was going to respray it. Plans for this thing is I'm going to be ended up painting that glass on the back side, I think. I think for right now, I don't know yet. Um, it's all scratched up and stuff, so I might as well go ahead and replay it, repaint it. We get some new brackets for here. Either that or tighten up the bolts inside of there because it's kind of loose right now. Let um, me get a new, new lock because I can't get a key for it. The key was stuck in there. I'm going to try to figure out something for this back window. I might end up putting another window in there or uh, figuring out something better than this piece of crap right here. Uh, first off, I'm going to go ahead and tape off that back window just in case I do want to keep it. Uh, take off this roof rack and sand down the whole entire thing. <coughs> So I got the whole back window taped off now. I'm gonna go ahead and pop this roof rack off, set it off to this side, we'll repaint that later. And then we go ahead and uh, start sanding this whole So I marked those eight so I could know which holes not to fill in, um, so I can put the roof back, roof rack right back where it is right now. Um, it's perfectly even, so I might as well not mess with it. Alright guys, so that's pretty much going to wrap it up for this video. Um, we go ahead and clean it and pick all this sil old silicone off the top of this. And I'll be done, but uh, I won't bore you guys with that. I'm going to make this into like a two or three part series, so just stay tuned for the rest of it. Next, I'm going to probably be either fixing this area or painting it. So, whichever one will be interesting. Thanks for watching, guys.